Hey guys, Silence Yell here. Welcome back to another Uta Macross Gacha video. If you guys are surprised that, you know, the home screen looks different, I think you're missing out on something. So go check out my previous video that I uploaded yesterday, um, talking about version 4.0.0's update, um, how you can navigate through this new home screen, and of course, basically the new um, auto setup function for your episode plates on your diva setup. Alright, so let's get down to the most important thing about today, which is the new 7 star episode plate for Melane, and of course, uh, how useful the episode plate is. So I do apologize if you guys can hear the airplane fly by my neighborhood. So, yeah, okay, so as usual, like I mentioned in the April, um, Event update. It's now a norm, you know, step up gachas for the featured 7 star episode plates is a thing now. And of course, we're gonna have two 7 star episode plates each month. So, for those of you who really cannot afford the singing stones or are not able to purchase stones due to some um, app store regulations or, you know, region lock stuff. Um, I, I, I feel you, I know how frustrating it is, especially if you, you want to, you know, fund the game and, and get your waifus or husband those uh, glorious looking episode plates. So yeah, anyways, let's take a look at Milane's 7 star episode plate. Um, and ooh, so it comes with a special note attached to it. So with that said, no need to ask. <laughs> This episode plate is definitely a must-get. It seems like all the recent 7-star episode plates uh, following up with Ranka and Cheryl's um, are stepping into the new limelight of being the meta of 7-stars. Who knows, maybe after all the 10 divas, or rather 9 divas plus Basara, um, have gotten their new 7-star episode plates with special note attached to them, Dana might introduce a new episode plate in the future? Who knows, maybe an 8 star episode plate, but we can only speculate. Anyways, let's take a look at the rest of the stats. So 4,341 total score, definitely very high um, considering that it's a 7 star episode plate. I think Cheryl and Rankas were around the same stat in, uh, in terms of total score. Uh, well balanced stats all around, of course you want to pay attention to who else is usable with this episode plate, uh, especially if the other divas are your waifus. So yeah, set the skill, as usual if it's used uh, on a Macross 7 song, you gain that double S wrecking skill. Um, yeah, so you get to boost your units total by 60% up, which is fantastic because you need that, especially when you want to attain a new high score um, to improve your Uta grade. Um, if you guys do not know what I'm talking about, please go check out all my other videos, uh, especially under the tutorial playlist. Of course, if you have the time, go check out all the gacha videos because sometimes I throw out information in gacha videos that are not in the tutorial playlist. So yeah, that's the thing. So, <laughs> um, let's take a look at the second page. Uh, active skill, same thing. If you manage to upgrade this episode plate to its 7 star form, you get to activate the activates, active, active skill. Why am I stuttering here? <laughs> active skill <laughs> twice as usual. Um, then of course it's life skill, which is, isn't the main selling point for this episode plate, but it's there for a reason. Um, at the 30 second mark for 12 seconds, you get your 50% boost in score. So alternatively, you can use this episode plate as a life skill support. Um, the life skill isn't that fantastic, but the stats on the episode plate is definitely the main selling point if you are planning to use it as a life skill support episode plate. Alright, so with that said, let's try and um, pull the step up gacha. Definitely, if you're looking at the step up, step up gacha, you have to pay attention to, um, you know, the cost of it. So the discounted first pull at 400 singing stones, 
Um, then of course, step two onwards, it's all 500 singing stones, but at least appearance rate of the 6 star episode plate is increased to 2%, which is 1% higher than normal, which is fantastic. Then of course, at step three, you have your guaranteed 5 star and above episode plates, so there is a chance that the 6 star will appear there as well, but you know, 5 star and above, it's tendency to be a 5 star. <laughs> La lastly, step 4, so you get that 2% appearance rate for 6 star episode plates. Uh, of course, there's a there's a big big up. I, I guess there's a chance, a uh, higher chance of another 1.4%. So that's always fantastic. So yes, the step up gacha is definitely the way to go. If you have the Singing Stone store up for it, if you guys are free to play and are not able to purchase Singing Stone packs, I will highly recommend you to save all your Singing Stones for especially when your waifu or husband knows featured gacha comes around, at least you are prepared for the step up gacha. So yeah, so looking at it here, you need 1005 Singing Stones plus 400, so it's 1900 Singing Stones. And of course, if you want to pull the discounted template pool here, um, you'll need a total of 2,200 singing stones just to, you know, fully enjoy the benefits of your Egypt waifu, waifu or husband knows gacha. So with all that said, I'm gonna go purchase my singing stone packs and I'll be right back with you in a short moment. Okay, I'm back with my purchase singing stones. Um, of course, I bought the 10,000 yen pack because that's the most worthwhile. Of course, you also get those seasonal spheres, which is good in the Chaos Exchange page um, to attain maybe some of the more rare items, um, like a rare up star. I don't know. Um, I don't think they have rare up stars there, but you know, like materials for improving your um, episodes of plates. Um, yeah, of course, lucky stones and all that kind of stuff. So yeah, anyways, we're gonna do the usual ritual. Um, my bad luck has been pretty bad ever since the Ranka and Cheryl 7 star or rather 6 star episode plates um, being pulled out. So we're gonna go with the usual trend. We're gonna do the single free pool first. Then of course, if the luck is still not there, we'll continue to use all the other free um, gacha pools to, you know, pull out the good luck. So here we go, the single free pool, as expected, no Valkyrie animations, it's not gonna end up good. Alright, and it retains its silver appearance, so there we go. So we do get an episode plate that doesn't appear that frequently, so that's not too bad. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead with the, let's see, do I have the daily pool? Yeah, I still have the... Afternoon daily pool. So yep, at this point of time that I'm recording, it's definitely past um, 12 noon. So yes, you should have your free daily pool as well. If you're watching this at this point of time uh, around the day. Okay, so yeah, we're still following the trend of rare um, common episode plates. So that might be a hint that we are definitely gonna go with something fantastic soon. So we're gonna go with the um, discounted 10 plate pool at 300 singing stones from the regular gacha first before we try our luck on the step up gacha. So here we go. All right, we get some decent load speeds there. Okay, so three Valkyrie animation, pretty mediocre. Two red boxes on the first bling. Ooh, you do get a rainbow box on the second bling. Uh, okay. 
Okay, the first red box did not evolve, so that's not too bad, at least. Um, I hope they keep the last red box and the rainbow box for last, so at least those have a chance of evolution. A lot of Makina though. Okay, so the rainbow box did not evolve. Ooh, not too bad. Okay, red box. There was a bit of a lag. There we go. Evolution. Do we evolve all the way? No. Oh! Merlane's birthday episode play. Interesting. <laughs> okay, at least we get one rare five star episode play. And apparently, the red box and the rainbow box gave me new episode plate so that's pretty interesting so let's see Freya's episode plate does it have a special note Ooh, nice pool okay <laughs> I'm pretty happy so aside from the rare birthday oh no it's not a birthday episode plate oh oh I thought it was because there was a cake there but okay aside from that Freya's episode plate is definitely a good get because it has a special note attached to it so definitely uh, episode plate to take note of if you guys are trying to pull Melane's gacha as well all right so that out of the way let's go with the step up gacha um, you can tell that the luck is there um, definitely hopefully um, we are trying to aim for the six star episode plate to appear at least from the step up gacha because the Discounted template pool on the regular gacha isn't exactly improved appearance rates, so yeah. Okay, so mediocre luck right there with a single Valkyrie. One red box on the first bling. Ooh, lots of red boxes, but you know, whether they'll evolve all the way above the rainbow, that's another thing. They're getting a lot of Machina episode plays though. Okay, two red boxes there. An episode plate on the lane. Lots of maki maki. Okay, here we go. No evolution on the red boxes, so it's kind of expected that the first discounted pool on the step up gacha will be horrible luck, considering that it has no improved rates of appearances. Uh, it's just discounted, that's all. So, okay, at least Mikumo's episode plate gets to evolve since I got a copy from the discounted pool the first time round. So, there we go. Ooh, Kanami makes appearance. Alright, fantastic. I'm still definitely not used to the new sound effects with version 4.0.0. Alright, so uh, before we do the second pool on the step out gacha, just a reminder, um, you guys know that we are getting free template pools, right? So make sure you take full advantage of the free pools to kind of flush out the good luck. Um, so from, from what I can tell, my luck is currently rolling, so I'm not going to waste my luck on the template pool that is free. Um, so I'm going to go with the step out gacha. So second step, um, we have that 2% chance of the 6 star episode plate appearance. So hopefully we do get it out. Because we need that episode plate for that bonus boost in score for the month of April. So I'm just hoping. Plus, you know, Melane is my number 4 favourite character or diva. You know, from the Macross franchise. Oh! 5? Valkyrie animations? That's looking good. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay, so it's likely that the red box is gonna evolve to a rainbow. The only problem is whether we'll get a 6 star episode play. Okay. There we go. Will it evolve all the way? Nope. Alright, that's fine. At least we do get 6 stars. I mean, 5 star episode plays. Okay. My lunch is ready. Yep, yeah, I'm recording this before I have my lunch. Alright, so kind of expected. Um, it would have been nice if the 6 star did appear. 
Oh well. A wasted uh, chance of that abuse on 2% appearance, but that's okay. Um, I'm expecting April to end up dry, but you know, I would definitely like to attain Reina's new 6 star episode plate that's coming soon. <laughs> so, uh, but still, that's a lot of money. Oh god. Here we go. So I will guarantee 5 star episode plate or higher. Okay, there it is, the guaranteed rainbow. Oh! Rainbow box on the first week. Ooh, two rainbow boxes. Hopefully one of them evolves. But don't forget, even though they evolve, there is a chance that you might attain an old 6 star. No evolution on this one. Ooh! Okay. Hopefully the last rainbow box evolves. Go. No evolution. Ah. Okay. That's fine. Oh, Kaname's plate evolves. If I'm not wrong, I think this whole set of Valkyrie's episode plates were the ones with the score note attached to them. There it is. Yeah. So, I guess if you, I I can't remember which diva from the Valkyrie team um did not have a special note attached to it. Was it Makina or Mikumo? I can't remember. But either way, if you see any of these um, costumes appear in your pools, I think it's fine even if you don't get a 6 star episode plate because these episode plates are definitely um, useful in terms of high score achievement. So here it is, the very last step. Um, you know, we still have that 2% appearance rate um, and you know, this is our last chance to really try and attain Melane's new 6 star piece of plate, although we could technically use the remaining singing stones to pull um, the regular gacha, but that's just really gambling it. <laughs> okay, decent load there. Here we go, fingers crossed. Okay, we are getting an average Valkyrie animation, but that doesn't mean we won't have a chance. Oh no. Alright, no evolution on the first red box. It looks like this pool is a flop. Okay, it's kind of sad. goes. No evolution. Yeah. Oh well. Yep, that's it. It's a dry pool. Oh dang it. Okay. So really wasted chance on that 2% appearance rate. Well, it's kind of expected. I mean, we don't exactly know how long of a dry spell um, it will be before the good luck comes again, considering how often do I get <laughs> such amazing pools like I did with Ranka and Cheryl. So anyways, um, it's not over, I still have my free template pool, we still have a thousand singing stones, so I don't know, I might give Milen another shot. So let's flush out the good luck again with the free template pool. If we end up getting something good from here, I'm gonna scream. <laughs> Oh boy! Here we go. Okay, seems like the bad luck is really flowing out right now. Okay, yeah, it's dry. Very dry. Oh no. What's with all the free free luck? Okay, we do get a lot. Valkyrie. There we go. Oh, I'll agree. And yeah, it's expected. Oh, Arrow Split evolves. Okay. I mean, considering that we pulled out Freya's and Kaname's 5 star episode play, I think 
the pool is pretty decent. We do get two useful episode plates, so that's not too bad. So anyways, the step up gacha has disappeared because yeah, once you put all four steps, there's no reason for the banner to be around. Um, yeah. So, 1000 singing stones, here we go guys, we're gambling with the regular gacha. Hopefully we do get Milane's 5, I don't know, 6 star episode plate. At least a single copy will do, not asking for an evolution. I have yet to see a pool for myself where at least I get 2 6 star copies in a single pool, but you know, it has happened to other people. Okay, mediocre Valkyrie animation. Single red box. Ooh! Two rainbows. Okay. Alright, red box doesn't evolve. A, lot, a bit more deep love for Mikumo. So hopefully the rainbow boxes get a bit of love. Here we go. We do get a bit of lag, but no evolution. Hmm. Okay. Hopefully the last rainbow box does something good. Here we go. Oh, <laughs> That Basara dove and goblin. <laughs> ah, such, a, such a cute illustration. Okay, so... Um, they are old episode plates and they don't exactly hold up as much anymore, so... Okay, we're gonna toss in that last 500 singing stones. That's it for Milane. Hopefully Reyna has a better chance. Okay, we do get some low. Here we go. Oh no. Oh! Okay, two red boxes in the first blink. A single rainbow box, so hopefully that single box delivers. Come on home! Oh. Okay, this play is really getting a lot of love. And that's it! It's unlikely this one would evolve. Ooh! This is new. <laughs> okay, so we do get, or rather, I do get new a, a new Milane plate. So, whose costume does this belong to? Oh, okay. So anyway, guys, it's been a dry spell for the month of April. Hopefully, the dry spell ends with Reina's seven-star episode plate gacha appearance later on. Um, I hope. At least I get my number two waifu <laughs> uh, episode plate. Um, so yeah, at least at least I will have a matching set of seven star costumes for Maki Reina. I mean, I did pull out Makina's six star episode plate. Um, so I'm really hoping for Reina's so I can at least do a live video recording of the two of them performing in that, those costume sets. So yeah guys, what do you guys think of Milane's new costume and episode plate? Uh, let me know your thoughts in the comments down below as usual. And of course, do all the wonderful stuff, like, subscribe and share. And I'll see you guys in Reina's Gacha episode plate video. Bye!